British shipbuilder Babcock is proposing its Arrowhead 140 design for the Hellenic Navy frigate requirement. The vessels, based on the future Type 31 frigate of the Royal Navy, are part of a wider package offer by the shipbuilder which partnered with Thales UK, and is supported by the British government. It recently surfaced that the Hellenic Navy need was not limited to new-built frigates. Their need is so urgent that they require a solution, consisting in the procurement of second-hand vessels or a lease of existing vessels as well as an upgrade to the in-service Hydra-class frigates. Arrowhead 140 is a proven, intelligent and adaptable frigate primed for Greece. It's a low-cost, high-value platform perfect for in-country build and future ready for modern, global navies. Babcock International, supported by the UK government, is forging a game-changing approach to global shipbuilding to offer warship design and build options to the Hellenic Navy for its next generation of new frigates. This exciting proposal enables the rejuvenation of Greek warship building and will deliver to the Hellenic Navy, the Arrowhead 140, a world-leading, highly capable, adaptable and affordable new frigate. As designed the platform has a range of high-end capabilities. This flexibility allows for the housing of related systems for enhanced air defense, maritime interdiction, self-protection and engagement of surface and land targets. It can host an array of weaponry to defend against saturation attacks by optimizing the resource required without comprising the primary missile systems. With generous provisioning of combat system compartments and cabling routes throughout the ship, the platform's design flexibility allows for a choice of command systems that takes into account the Greek preference for combat system components, C4I and CMS systems which can be easily incorporated and integrated into the platform. Arrowhead 140 delivers high levels of operability, adaptability and reliability, providing the Hellenic Navy with operational choice and confidence in operational performance. A multi-mission surface combatant, the frigate is capable of providing force protection, conducting surface, anti-air, anti-submarine and electronic warfare operations, and is operationally highly proficient. Based on a proven NATO frigate design, it offers flexible spaces able to host disaster relief stores or civilians during evacuation operations amongst other roles. A capability already employed within the in-service design. Large boat bays with flexible launch and recovery capability to operate a variety of different offboard assets, such as RHIBs, unmanned underwater vehicles and unmanned surface vehicles able to deliver a range of roles from interdiction missions to special forces operations and literal maneuver exploitation. There is the ability to hold Arctic 28 boats measuring 8.7 meters in length. The Arrowhead 140 flight deck is designed for a wide range of naval aircraft and air systems, with a hangar that can accommodate an organic medium naval helicopter such as a MH-60 Seahawk combined with unmanned air systems. Dedicated aviation magazine facilities to store and prepare air-launched weapons including ASW torpedoes and anti-surface missiles are provided. In addition, a fueling system to provide HIFR capability from a proven NATO flight deck is incorporated. The large flight deck provides the flexibility to launch and recover non-organic aircraft up to 15T in weight. Arrowhead 140 can operate with a ship's company of less than 100 personnel. With dedicated accommodation for 180 plus personnel and additional temporary accommodation, the platform can carry a significant number of embarked military force, including special forces, littoral maneuver troops or additional command and control personnel. Its wide beam provides operational flexibility and its space-rich design is efficient to build and efficient to maintain, with ship stability and crew comfort at its heart. For sailors, Arrowhead 140 will provide a modern place to live, a great place to work and a highly capable multi-role frigate no matter where in the world it operates, making long-term global forward deployment achievable and sustainable. Looking beyond the initial design, build and mobilization of the frigates, through life support of the ships is inbuilt from the beginning. The Babcock through life support offering assures ship availability and readiness. However the support Babcock provides is not just about technology on its own but importantly includes the integration of people, processes and technology and through novel mobile, remote and connected technology, we can provide the maintainer with an in-depth understanding of the performance, maintenance and material condition of their assets. This is centered around embedded technology that provides systems and equipment performance monitoring, enabling informed rapid decision making. Arrowhead 140 is designed for performance and through life support. Our proposal is for the ships to be built in Greece, however we will ensure the build strategy is sufficiently flexible to protect the schedule and to deliver the Hellenic Navy's requirement. 
Our goal is to work with Greek industry to support the reinvigoration of a domestic supply chain, investment in infrastructure to modernize and equip domestic facilities, upskill and grow local workforces and to transfer knowledge and technology, Vice President of Business Development, Jonathan Walton said. The platform's heritage and clever design enhancements enable improved warship capability whilst retaining its proven strengths. International customers also benefit from the design being chosen for the next generation of UK Royal Navy Type 31 frigates through non-recurring expenditure and accurate known costs for design and build delivery. This is a modular build, an approach which Babcock has proved effective through the construction of the UK Royal Navy's aircraft carriers. This approach optimizes the buildability of the ships from design, assuring the effective transfer of a UK design to global shipyards for efficient manufacture and assembly and de-risking the build program while delivering wider national and regional prosperity. Our experience in platform refit and maintenance means that we have extensive knowledge of the supportability and usability of platforms and understand fully the effects of design in action. The Arrowhead 140 design, based on the hull form of the Ivor Huitfeldt class currently in service with the Danish Navy, was selected for the UK Type 31 frigate program in 2019. This program is currently underway in Babcock's Resyth facility in Scotland. The steelwork frame for a new assembly hall in Resyth is now complete with its cladding being applied. All major and long lead supply chain contracts have been placed to date representing almost a third of all contracts and nearly 80% of the value. Steel will be cut to begin construction of the first Type 31 by end of 2021, providing assurance of a partner which is primed to deliver, Jonathan Walton said. The baseline Arrowhead 140 design can be configured to meet the broad range of operational requirements and profiles a global frigate may be called upon to undertake and adopt. In selecting Arrowhead 140, tailored to Greece's strategic and operational needs and coupled with a high amount of bespoke equipment and systems variants, the Hellenic Navy would be capitalizing upon a fully developed frigate design and build program while working alongside a world-class, experienced warship builder in Babcock, primed to support Greece in the delivery of its naval fleet of the future. Operational roles will change through the life of the ship. And with a displacement of around 6,000 T Arrowhead 140 provides ample space, sufficient flexibility and adaptability for a multi-role capability to meet changing operational needs, ranging from task group and high-end warfare operations to constabulary and humanitarian duties. Arrowhead 140 is able to detect and engage surface ships, aircraft and missiles over the horizon, detect and engage submarines, defend convoy ships, employ active and passive electronic warfare systems, defend against swarming small boat attacks and UAVs, carry, deploy, operate and recover autonomous vehicles. The Royal Navy will deploy the Type 31 predominantly in a maritime security role. The Hellenic Navy will require its frigates to perform a different range of operational tasks. The Arrowhead 140 platform is uniquely adaptable to accommodate a wide range of systems and equipment needed for multiple naval capabilities, including those required by the Hellenic Navy.